Today, I would like to share a short experience that I have for the past years. So, today's topic, I would like to talk about 10 characteristics of an entrepreneur who succeeds. I cannot say I'm very successful, but I managed to get what I need to proceed in life as an entrepreneur. So you can read more about these 10 characteristics on the blog and I will share the link together with the video. Very importantly, these are the characteristics I would like to repeat and again and tell whoever would like to start your own business online. Never before uh, online business become a model and to me, this is just the beginning of the online business era. In year 2020, many people started and many people give up and many people are very successful as well. So we'd like to just quickly go through the 10 characteristics, basically the, the first one, you must believe in yourself, believe you can deliver. Yeah. Uh, do not worry about those noises that talking about you. Basically, they do not understand the business model they do not understand the potential. Yeah. So that is uh, a gap. That's why there is a gap. It does not matter individual or small and medium sized company. There is a gap. There's still many gaps between uh, online digital marketing and um, the actual industrial digital marketing they are doing today. You know, there are still gaps which you can add value. So know that you are worthy. Yeah. You know you'll be able to provide and as a good provider you must able to listen. A great listener in the business is very important. Number four is you be able to solve any problems that ahead of you. Um, just like uh, gaps between industrial digital marketing, which is what everyone talking about in digital digital marketing, those graduates. Uh, are pursuing versus a resourceful digital marketing. Yeah, so that is gap in between and that is where G Cloud Web Holes fill up the gaps between the industry, industrial digital marketing and resourceful digital marketing. Yeah. That is the between. So you have to be resourceful in whatever you have you are doing. Ambitious, that is the key. Yeah. Hardworking, you have to constantly, constantly work out resolve solution. Yeah. And beside as a provider in your business, you must be a giver as well. Uh, I give many competitors of mine some consultation advice, yeah, free of charge. So basically, they call up or make appointment with me and ask for the information what I'm doing. So I'm just sharing. I'm just give, yeah. Uh, I'm I'm not afraid of competitors. I'm not afraid of people asking information from me. So that is one of the key points. 
Um, and you'll be able to provide uh, value. Yeah. So provide value and own your your business. The ownership of the business, the responsibility, the accountability of the business is very important. I only work with company or clients who trust me. Uh, I will accountable for whatever implementation that I promise. I'm responsible for their uh, KPI. So that is the value I'm providing to small and medium-sized company. Yeah, and that is the key value. I never give up trying, and not only trying because I have have seen many good results in my past implementation for my client, for myself, for my friends. So I'm not worried that I will not be able to resolve their problems. Um, I'm just worried that whether uh, I have time uh, to take on more customers. So I set myself uh, a, uh, a limitation. Okay, So I, I only take five customer clients max at uh, one time. So uh, they are overlapping each other. So that is the maximum customer I'm taking currently. I'm not able to look into further customer uh, unless um, I have existing customer are comfortable and they can be independent. Then I will be taking on more clients in this case. So in conclusion, um, as uh, entrepreneurs, you must have all these characters in order to work out a solution for yourself, a solution for your consumer and your customer or clients so that they can trust you. You have to accountable for whatever implementation you promise, responsible for uh, whatever outcome and drive result. The result is important because they are paying you for the good result, not otherwise. All right. That's all I would like to share in this uh, video. Thank you very much and cheers.